hello everyone it's me is somebody welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorials and i got this image into internet and uh, i decided to change this one into a creative way so let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications press ctrl or command j for the new copy of this layer and after that here is a selection and here is object selection in 2022 you are getting this select all the stops and 2021 you are getting this so select subject you can try with, with this one and go to the select and mask options from here here is the here refiner and here's the black options you can here refining options you can refine the here or from here you can remove the edges like this if you want so if you don't want too much age shift it you can use that yeah that's fine and here layer with the layer mask and hit okay so our layer mask is like that this portion actually this one is turn on and select this one again from here by pressing the control or command selecting this and going so going to the select options going to the modify and expand options from here 60 pt and expand it or you can go to the edit options so select this one actually this layer and edit and continuer from the fill and it will be gone and hit ok so that's fine and now select these two things making it like this and now i'll change it up so before that taking solid color like a gray type color from here hit ok and g from the keyboard before that you have to mask it out g from the keyboard and delete this portion that's fine and now press ctrl or command t making it bigger yeah that's fine now i can use here another type of sky so i download this one from the unsplash.com and i'll provide you that link or here is the sky replacement options you can use or apply like that going to the file and place embedded options selecting this and it will place over there and now you can select the ground or other things from here so field you can find out a field which is really help you out to do that so this field is good selecting this field saving it out and going to the photoshop again going to the place embedded options this field okay that's fine making it bigger and placing into downside of this actually here even turning it off turning it off so v press control command okay now nice and now i will make it a little bit bigger that's good and in this portion i'll brush over there so from here go to the brush be from the keyboard and you can take any kind of brush like grass type brush we'll change it out later so here it should be from this okay brush over there not too much so a little bit brush it looks like the feet is under the grass it look like that just because of when you work in the grass uh, grass will be like that okay now taking blank layer and making create the uh, create some uh, like uh, shadows so selecting this brush and select once so press ctrl or command t you can make it bigger and making it little bit like that and place over there and opacity a little bit down okay that's fine just control command t and make the brush like that or shadow like this control command j and control command t and it will be like this so a shadow would be like that and you can mask those and you can delete the front portion and delete okay this one as well okay 
that's fine so you should have to blend this one by pressing the multiply and making the opacity down yeah and now little bit shadow will appear in this portion so you can make copy you can apply this one apply layer mask and now this one is only the photo press ctrl or command j this one will be shadow and now select by pressing ctrl or command and making it black color okay this one is black like that okay that's fine press ctrl or command t and taking this one by pressing this point and this point placement so let's apply that select this one going to the file and going to the edit and sky replacement from here you can replace the sky uh, here is the options you can import the sky here is the scale you can make it bigger brightness here is scale options you can make smaller or bigger and you can put this one according to this okay that is fine and hit okay so our sky is replaced by that and here is our option to do adjustment or everything so now this one is not harmonized with this uh, one that means the background layer so we should do this first so making it group and making it convert to smart object and group one and this one going to the filter and going to the nearby filter from here the harmonize this one turning it on select the layer that is the group one it will take time and it will be harmonized with the from here little bit warm type and hit okay okay this one and now make the opposite a little bit down now that's fine so this one is the harmonized and you can use the other things so here now time to color grading select all the stuffs making it into convert to smart object and now going to the filter and camera filter so from here color should be basic from here make it a little bit warm type and exposure a little bit down contrast like this or texture a little bit down curves i'll make like this okay into the color mixture going to the green i'll make the green like this and like this saturation of the red orange and everything luminance of the orange i'll increase and calibration from the primary blue primary i'll make this one little bit like that and like that and let's see before and after and hit okay so now select this one again going to the filter again and going to the nick collection and color effects pro so from here i'm using the cross processing and lots of method over here which one is perfect for your photography which method do you want to use i want to use the t04 and hit okay let's see the before one was like that and after one you're getting like this so you can do lots of work from here actually this photo so shadow highlighting dodge and burn and this shadow press controller command j this shadow and make this one another copy actually making this one like that according to this actually this okay make the opacity or fill up and down it will make more sense okay now dodge and burn process how to make the dodge and burn so taking another layer and making this one into like a create clipping mask and after that going to the edit options and going to the fill options and 50 percent gray from here and hit okay and this one actually it should be the upper side of this and create clipping mask okay 50% gray and make this one into overlay and after that going to the dodge burn process from here the burn for the black that means the shadow and dodge for the highlight so burn from the burn tool and making this one a little bit like this okay and from the dodge tool i'll make 
or increase the highlight from here so let's see the difference that is the flat image but in this portion you are getting the dimension of this saving this one this one is smart object and it will affect in your uh, previous window so let's go to the previous window so now this one is more realistic than the previous so before one the raw image and uh, that is a stock image and after one you're getting the nice effect with the uh, theory or everything what i have done so here is some we are getting some grain over there how to remove grain going to the filter and the camera filter and from this portion we'll go to the detailing options noise reduction and color noise reduction and adding some sharpening by pressing hold the alter option button and now the grain and not grain and hit ok so you are getting the uh, realistic image if you want you can add some vignetting or like a shadow over there how to do that so going to the back layer over there and from this portion i'm going to the gradient options and adding some black type gradient so like this actually this this one but i want to make this one the opacity like zero okay and making it reverse and here i should be make this one a little bit like that and this gradient i should make this one multiply and it will make dimension actually the downside of the things okay it's make the dimension actually so before and after you are getting this so in this portion you are getting all the stuffs like that hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section and uh, until the next video i mean i'm signing out stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers Bye bye